here the girl is wishing good morning to the sky sun little winds that runs which means the cool breeze cool air flow in the morning and also the girl is wishing good morning to the birds trees creeping grass and brownie bees see next teacher teacher will read the uh, next lines how did you find out it was day how did you find out it was day the girl asked all the birds trees sun and the sky that how did they come to know about the new day and also that who told them the night is over so they want to uh, she want to know how the birds sun and sky know about the new day had arrived or how they uh, how the night is over how did they know the night is over then next uh, i am wide awake i am up now too i will be right out to play with you and then she says that now i am also awake now i am not sleeping i woke up and out of my bed i came out of my bed so i am coming out in the garden to play with all of you now i am coming out of the bed to the garden and i play will i i play with the all of you she is very happy to play with all these uh, things in the garden okay children understand the poem hi children now you can learn new words from this poem you have understood the meaning of the poem in that poem you may uh, not feel there with this verse creeping away gone away creeping it is there under the poem uh, this poem is written by fanny r buchner Fa fanny r buchner and uh, you you can find three words under the poem that is new words for you creeping creeping you can see uh, pumpkin uh, plant is creeping on the ground moving along the ground moving along the ground or any other surfaces see uh, pumpkin uh, plant is uh, it's uh, uh, that plant is growing along the ground pumpkin so uh, creeping is moving along the ground snail and uh, snail all uh, animals are creeping on the ground creeping on the ground the movement is on the ground like uh, creeping okay then awake awake means no sleep or wake up morning i will uh, awake 6 o'clock so you can say uh, morning i will wake up 7 o'clock or like that so wake up awake awake means wake up or not sleep not in sleep okay the next word go away here in this poem end the meaning is end end here to go at a particular distance from a place from here to there from here to there go going uh, moving from here to there is called gone away i have gone away from here to there i have gone away from here to there from a particular distance moving from one place to another place moving is more gone away so these are the three words you can um, uh, find in this poem not familiar for you so teacher has given this words and 
do you have any other words brownie bees brownie bee means brown colored bees brown color bees and uh, wide awake means woke up that time woke up that only and uh, these are the new words from the poem okay i hope you understood this one if you want you can write it in your notebook okay and send to me